Hello everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will introduce to everyone 10 amazing combat upgrade mods in Minecraft. The first mod of the video will be Better Combat. The mod will upgrade the animation of using weapons for Minecraft players. Applies to all weapons in the game. The mod will make the fighting in Minecraft more realistic and increase the combat experience when using the third-person perspective. With this mod, you will be able to upgrade many elements in the game such as fancy attack animations, accurate weapon collision detection, weapon combos, and if you want to use first person with arm animation, go to settings and enable show arm in first person. When using the first person perspective, you can see the action of the arm using the weapon in the best way. The feeling is so real, something vanilla Minecraft doesn't have. Of course, it's much better to use it to attack and kill monsters. The second mod is simply swords. The mod would give Minecraft a lot of different melee weapons. Includes longsword, twin blade, rapier, cutlass, claymore. This weapon mod can perfectly combine with better combat and create completely new attack patterns that are really cool. With such diverse weapons, it will open up a lot of fighting styles and tactics for Minecraft. You will no longer be bored with the default weapon mods of the game. Refresh the list of weapons in the game. Weapons from mods are like upgraded and remade from weapons in the game. Most of them are made from materials that everyone knows when playing Minecraft such as iron and diamonds. Weapons don't make the game too easy or too hard because the weapon's damage isn't too different from the default weapon. However, the mod also has special weapons and unique skills that can be activated on mobs, and the damage of the skill will surely enchant you. As here you can see the skill of this sword will help you pierce through creeper and turn on stealth mode to fight. Or the sides that have the ability to steal souls and deal splash damage. Or the axe that you just need to surf and all monsters will taste burnt and have the ability to return to the position before surfing. Or an ice hammer that has the ability to freeze opponents to deal damage and can even freeze itself to provide a healing effect. And if you want the weapons in the movies, it's easy to meet. The third mod will be a mod that provides acrobatic abilities for Minecraft players, for the purpose of more flexibility in combat. With the ability to fight acrobatics, you can easily dodge enemy attacks and restore your own health. I think it should be applied to monsters with high difficulty then the effect of somersault will become obvious. The fourth mod that is an indispensable combat mod in this list is Epic Fight. Epic Fight transforms Minecraft's combat system into RPG style not only for players but also for hostile creatures. If you want to experience some different battle styles in Minecraft, Epic Fight would be the best option. With each different weapon, Epic Fight also has its own animation, attack and skill, giving players a new and exciting feeling. Depending on the preferences of each player, there will be the best choice between Epic Fight and Better Combat. Both have something new and special compared to Minecraft Vanilla. You can also set both and turn them on and off based on the time of battle. The fifth mod is Better Third Person. This is a mod that gives you a better third person perspective. Allows you to freely rotate camera for 360 degrees. Allows you to walk in 8 directions without changing camera rotation. Still allows you to place, break and use items in third person. Provides full freedom of the camera when moving. And be sure with those great additions, you can fight better thanks to the flexibility that third person brings. If you are not a fan of swords or melee weapons, we have a brand new mod. The sixth mod is Alliance of Valiant Arms Guns. Give you a lot of guns from pistols, rifles, machine guns, sniper rifles. With the mechanism taken from the game of the same name Alliance of Valiant Arms, so you can see how to change ammunition or display the kill like you are playing a real shooting game. 
Each gun will have a skin for you to choose from with many different colors and that is also the special thing of this mod compared to most other mods. In the official game you have to spend money to experience, but here it is completely free. It is undeniable that gamers are especially fond of gun skins. And this is the real experience when you use guns on creatures in Minecraft. It seems a bit too strong and does a lot of damage. However, it will really suit the monster mods that I will introduce to you in the second half of the video. The seventh mod is called Enemy Expansion. The mod will give Minecraft a lot of new monsters that are upgraded from normal monsters in the game. It is a mod that aims to make combat encounters in Minecraft more varied and interesting with the introduction of several new mobs. With the variety of monsters spawned in the game, you will definitely have a much better fighting experience. The upgraded monsters in the game will have the ability to match the added weapon, maybe. Of course, a mob of monsters will have strong or weak ones and those with special abilities that can stop the fire from your guns. The eighth mod is Epic Paladins. This is a mod about armor. It will give you a lot of armor with many different shapes that look extremely beautiful and strong. With looks inspired by real or imaginary characters like knights, dragon knights or angels. In addition to armor there are weapons that are made to match the armor that are also very compatible with the better combat mod, it looks cool when fighting. The armor when worn will give the player an effect such as night vision, speed, or even flying. Now comes the really powerful bosses that you will be fighting, the ninth mod will revive one of the most famous legendary characters of Minecraft that is Herobrine. About the power of Herobrine, you do not need to argue anymore. A character that used to be the fear of Minecraft players is now being remade as a boss that you need to overcome. You should prepare yourself with the best armor to be able to fight Herobrine as I am currently using the strongest healing effect otherwise I would really be knocked down with it. The netherite armor with only one attack has been broken so much then you can understand how strong it is. Hero Brine, when receiving more damage will gradually wear the armor of the same name with it, and the protection will definitely be much better than the netherite armor. In addition, it also summons disciples to attack the player and rescue. And looking at the damage that powerful guns do, it's really not that much. When you kill it, you will have the ability to get shards and part of armor. The final mod is from the shadows. This is an additional mod about a really cool looking monster called Nehemoth. This is a boss that works at night so during the day it will be petrified and unable to attack. But when night falls, you really feel the worth of this boss. When attacking, this boss will be very flexible in movement from grabbing players, scratching or even jumping to approach you, it will cause an earthquake. When bitten you will get a bleeding effect and can't heal even though I currently have the highest level super healing effect. Okay and that's all I want to show you in this video. I have introduced good mods for you to upgrade the battle mode in Minecraft so if you find this video good, please leave me a like and subscribes. Thanks for watching.